uh, Ben Godro for signing a sting, uh, goalie from Corbeil, Ontario. He picked the seventh overall pick in this year's Ontario High League priority selection. The looseness circles here. Lockhart pokes a loose on the back door. Another stop by Goldro as he denies Connor Lockhart. And over to Pinchuk. Pinchuk, nice toe drag ends up all alone. Oh, what a glove save there <laughs> by Goudreau on Vitaly Pinchuk. Yeah, so I'd probably say that I'm kind of like a butterfly hybrid. Uh, I definitely kind of go down, uh, try to make saves down almost the time. Uh, and play around the butterfly and, and the reverse VH and the post and stuff like that. But I'm um, getting better at holding my feet and making those saves standing, so it's a little bit of improvement there. Uh, I'd say my best skill uh, is probably just being able to be square to the puck, uh, make the save. Uh, especially over the summer, I've worked a lot on my hands and stuff like that. Uh, and keep the pucks to my body. Uh, so I'd say like rebound control on my hands. Probably my two biggest strengths right now. The Sarnia's thing are pleased to select with their first round selection. Ben Goudreau from the North Bay Midgets. The earliest we've seen a goaltender in a long time chosen. I remember many years ago we had one go fourth overall. In this case now, number seven, Ben Goudreau goes to the Sarnia Sting. Uh, I think being drafted that high, I was going into my first couple games, I kind of held that ex expectation. I got to play and be ready to play right away. Um, so it was, it was stressful to start to kind of get going. Uh, but I learned to kind of just forget about it. Uh, just go play my game. Uh, I started to kind of figure that out. Started to kind of find my way. So the upcoming draft, I'm trying to, kind of trying to forget about the rankings and stuff like that. Uh, I'm just go playing my game. Uh, actually, not playing with him a long time now. Um, drink, the rankings don't really mean much, so I'm just trying to kind of focus on my game. Trot, cutting in here to the circle, but out in front of the net. Nice stop there by Godro's Carroll. Right out in front of the net. Stevenson, he's looking for another, and Godro comes across to make a nice stop. Yeah, I think the OHL uh, has definitely helped me kind of prepare myself for the uh, NHL draft process by just like teaching me how hard I got to work, uh, teaching me what to kind of expect uh, through the draft process. Um, and just kind of the all around kind of picture of kind of getting up and kind of developing and maturing. Um, I think it's such a great program for that. And I mean, we've got a great coaching staff in Sarnia. Um, all of them had experiences in pro hockey, uh, even my goalie coach at Sarnia. Uh, he's been a really big part of kind of this past year. Uh, I've been doing a lot of training with him. Um, I think he's personally kind of taken it upon himself just to kind of help me um, get ready for the draft. Uh, if I have any questions, he's always there. Um, then last year we had David Legwan on the bench who was always in my corner, always helping me out. Um, we were pretty close, so I think just having those kind of guys to talk to. Um, obviously Brad Staub, it's another one. Uh, he's always kind of our guys in the gym, so him pushing me in the gym, I think, has always kind of helped me develop in there and kind of taught me what I got to be ready for uh, at the next level. And then moving on to this year with Mark Mancari, um, he's going to be an awesome addition to us. Kind of got to meet him a few times and just talk to him, and he seems like an awesome guy and he's really willing to push you. Um, and same thing goes for uh, Darian Hatcher, uh, just another great guy. Uh, really pushes you and kind of demands that pro level uh, play. Good job to cover up and have no harm. Benelli, Patizzi and Rob by Gaudreau. Benjamin Gaudreau comes across and left hand larceny robs Patizian of a goal. Such great pace as he cuts down the off wing, cuts to the outside, cuts to the net, poked away on a good play by Gaudreau. I haven't really been out of the gym since. Uh, I've been kind of in the gym the whole time, uh, just kind of trying to prepare as much as possible. Um, been getting on the ice as much as I possibly can. Uh, we've been locked down obviously now. Uh, and I think North Bay took their ice out around Christmas time, so I haven't really been on the ice too much in North Bay, but I do a lot of driving down in Toronto and stuff to get ice, um, just to kind of stay fit and stay ready. Um, especially once I kind of heard about U18 and stuff like that, uh, that it was kind of a thing that might happen. Uh, I started going down to Toronto almost every week, getting four or five ice sessions in. Uh, just trying to stay ready, stay ready to go. So you get a, is there any chance you get to kind of represent your country? Uh, it's awesome. Uh, so going away to U18s in such a kind of weird year, uh, it's even more awesome. Um, can't thank everyone enough for kind of the, that have helped me out uh, and given me this chance to go. So cuts to the outside. Douglas sets up Boca. Nice save by Gaudreau. 
Down to a minute seven to go. Erie behind the net, trying to get it back in front. Fowler denied by Goldrow. I think for me, uh, probably like a former uh, Memorial Cup champion, uh, Ken Appleby in town. Um, he used to play for the Oshawa Generals and he was doing that. I was pretty young, so I kind of looked up to him as another North Bay guy, uh, another goalie. Uh, and even now we work out together and do stuff together. So it's just kind of getting to kind of see that at the pro level and just watch him and kind of learn off him. Uh, and then my goalie coach, Todd Robler, again from North Bay. Another guy that's always kind of been in my life since day one. Follows up here, nice pass with speed. Goal on, twisted in front. Here's a stop by Goldro as he robs Yetman on the one-timer. Two on one, short handed. Ups and two, Kaz Wismer fed him, shoots, big save from Goudreau. The dream kind of started for me about playing in the NHL, probably since I was like four or five, watching the Maple Leafs on TV. Um, I was my favorite team back in the day, and just kind of watching them uh, play and stuff like that. I think I always wanted to be uh, in the NHL playing there. Uh, started with many sticks down in the basement and then under the ice. So, yeah, I mean, uh, the emotions for sure on draft day, uh, they're going to be up and down and kind of all over the place. Uh, it's going to be a pretty stressful day, uh, but I think once I kind of finally hear my name called, it'll be pretty awesome. I'll be pretty happy. I'll have to thank my parents for sure. Uh, my goalie coach Todd Robillard, uh, all the Sarnia staying staff, um, all my teammates, uh, my former teammates and everybody that's kind of been around me. Um, it's helped me throughout my hockey career.